doors. Something wrong here. <laughs> Hello, YouTube. My name is Mike with Where's My Toque Entertainment, and this is my top five places to visit in Nova Scotia. Number five. Located a mere 30 minutes from downtown Halifax, Peggy's Cove is much colder and 10 times windier, no matter what the season, so bundle up. From the huge waves to the great lighthouse, Peggy's Cove has so much to check out. They have many homemade gift shops and amazing restaurants that serve only the freshest seafood. If you get bored watching the waves, there's also hiking trails, kayaking, whale watching, stunning beaches, and even a golf course. Number 4 Citadel Hill is located right at the heart of central Halifax and has been there for over 160 years. Citadel Hill was originally built back in the 1700s as a military fortification to protect the Empire. But now it's open for tourists! They offer guided tours, ghost tours at night, and they even let you be a soldier in the 1800s for a day. I can't forget to mention they fire the cannons off every day at a specific time. Number 3 Located roughly 30 minutes from Shelburne, if you're someone that wants to get away from the city, Thomas Radall Provincial Park is the place to camp next summer. With spaces for campers and tents, Thomas Radall accepts drivers and walk-ons alike. The park provides plenty of camping space, a fantastic beach, and plenty of multi-purpose trails for hikers and cyclists. Number 2 Victoria Park is located at the heart of Truro, but be prepared to climb because Victoria Park is full of crazy staircases and trails like the infamous Jacob's Ladder. The scenery throughout Victoria Park has been described by many as breathtaking. From the large hilltop climbs to the gorgeous waterfalls, this park brings out the adventurer in you. They have a water spray park, a pool, and a massive band shell where they host events for all ages. Number 1 The Cape Breton Highlands National Park is located in the northern part of Cape Breton and is not recommended for non-experienced hikers. The views will take your breath away to say the least. Rated one of the most scenic drives in the world, the Cabot Trail stretches through 950 square kilometers of highlands and coastal wilderness. The park includes 26 hiking trails, 8 campgrounds, 6 beaches and numerous waterfalls. And thank you, YouTube. That is my top five places to visit in Nova Scotia. Don't forget to drop a like, uh, subscribe, and you can do that if you want to, I guess.